In game? Wait, what did. All right, right off I'm the going bat, to kill myself I now, thanks in game. Notorious. Still no Lilia, Don't do man. it. Those are the two strongest Kraken. win rate junglers who were falling. What would I ever do without walk? you? Anyways, uh, we got Karma Jace Bans so is a Varus add, first pick. Ash is up. No, we're not going by first going pick. The squishy. fuck is that? By first Otherwise, pick? Like, what, am I missing yeah. something? Here's, they don't even have a comp yet, bro. Now the other team goes Varus. Or they just go some, like... They could go some Draven or not later on. But yeah, I mean, they can go Varus and a TK. I mean, set a TK is great into buy. That's also no, great. The first draft that they had, you got to Cassante. see the Cassante. Uh, I'm down with Cassante. All right. Uh, I'm imagining Normally, we'll just answer top here with like Aatrox FBI, would be uh, standard. Be then TK will be so on three. On to what's gonna be Poppy with into to Cassante. It's a fine matchup, but I don't really like what I'm seeing right here. And we got us some lag. I mean, it's TK for sure, bro. I mean, they could go Senna, or sorry, Senna Seraphine, but I don't think you do it, bro. Not for Cassante. I you also, want to do in that the back of my mind, though, so what you do here generally is you take uh, Tom Kenji, you ban Rakan. Ash ban is fine. Rakan ban is what I want to see here. In the top lane, but when I mean, look, low key, strongest, like Lucian Milio should be good here. Between, but it's it's uh, like Yeon. I will say a risk that so you're like, is it really when like, you come up, on. like like in this instance like no no flame that, but it is you really Lucian. need like a hyper carry you've seen it before like he's like he's actually just dying in lane in the most like disgusting ways I think you just ban Rakan like, so get the Zyra Khan out I mean you out, could so ban Milio or Lucian you can Morthal I would accept it. Paris, I don't understand that, bro. Like, in this case. okay, uh, it's North America, bro. In North Korkin? America, don't you just go Zyra Khan uh, yeah. every single time here? Every favorite. single time you just go Zyra Khan? Zyra Khan, I mean, if you expect us to be Zyra Khan, what are you going as jungle here? You don't want to go Sejuani. I mean, you could just go Maokai, honestly. Oh, yeah, that's a very NA comp. Maokai is pretty annoying for Rakan as well. You could just go like Maokai and then like a control mage mid. You'll probably just win. It, it is interesting to contrast I mean, look, it's with probably Palafox, just North American mid -layers. Maokai Corky or some uh, bullshit. Touted. Palafox had a long time trying to work his Isn't way Lucian into the scene. the easiest AD carry in the game? Hell no, bro. Probably one of the hardest. Worlds and has been, you know, kind of focused on here. We're so picking jungle here, by the way. I refuse to, to let you out. pick top lane or pick mid lane here. <laughs> okay, if they're going Corky, <laughs> I guess it's fine if they have like the a unique pick for contract. In. If there's something special he wants oh, to pick. Yeah, Ezreal Bard. Yeah. Ooh, okay. okay. I guess I'm kind of down Mortal with it. I mean, what I mean, is the Bard jungle pick? Can, contract, let's see it. Because I thought it was just going to be a Maokai, but I guess if they're going Oriana and not, I mean, they could they could just be going something like Nocturne here, but I don't think it's very good. Actually, yeah, I don't I don't know, man. That's like, I don't, like, what jungle would you yeah, pick? Yeah. That a lot. R5 jungle, it's, and it's, it could be a Graves, but I don't really like it that much, to be honest. This doesn't seem like a very energy comp to me, to be honest. Harder, I just don't, I, I don't like these types of drafts. Like, energy's draft is just so, like, it's like, you just don't have anything that you can make plays off of, really. It's just like, all right, guys, play your lanes well, and then we just, like, group up and try to fight objectives or something. I think it's so much easier for TL to play the game. Zir. Some people go Halo Blades in this match. Up. I'm not a huge fan of uh pieces of that energy team that surprised I'm not a huge fan of Halo Blades. I like Fleet better. I think you guys go Fleet every game. Okay, so Palafox just beats the shit out of APA for a living, bro. Nice. All of the time, and APA has been been I mean, contracts longer. can invade so Umti pretty easily. In their first 34 games each, as uh, we are seeing Graves actually in. Bro, I don't even so think he needs the auto the there. I think he should have just chilled for a bit. Over on that drag, Let Umti so keep on tanking it for Umti. a little bit longer. No way his laners can actually come and so, help him. So Umti, let's see what he does. Some people go wolves here. Other people will run straight to enemy red. It's pretty risky to run straight day, to enemy red though no i've so seen it before though is very low if you walk over a ward the whole game ends i mean contracts literally side, just like does just smart shit every point. single game no, like his, his, his early pathing is just the best in lcs well. he always gets an advantage for like his team or for himself he normally does it in an aggressive way yes he hasn't even played a full split oh, Umti is going to get yet. fisted if he does this. Okay, Umti looking for a counter jungle on the enemy it's red. Low but it looks like Contracts was already passing up here I mean, himself. this is a WQ. Oh, yeah, my God, bro. There. Umti's trying to get away. First shot into his back. Flashes away, trying to escape. Okay. Ball breaker there he loses his flash. He escape on I think this that Contracts should probably follow him here. I actually Raises think Contracts should follow him, most likely. Kind of an I think you just follow him into his jungle and you just, like, bully the out of him here because you have mid prio and poppy carry, doesn't want to move i think well, i mean it depends on poppy's wave state actually maybe poppy crashed the wave but i guess he thinks that, that he has really enough of an advantage he just wants to clear his um krugs and his raptors the and then this is like where he has an option he could take red but he could also leave the red and then just go base right now and then go to bot side and then clear up and then on the next clear he can go for uh grubs that's what a lot of people would like to do so 
This Not is only number four. Just really had him downloaded. Both of them playing these mid laners that can really carry the game. Dokla trying to get away now. Impact Ooh, chasing out okay. here with a steadfast presence. Smart from uh, Dokla. He didn't cast his W. Before it was exactly. If he panicked so he and W the there, the then um, the an Impact deck. would. Impact just slightly too late on that. Yeah, Impact would the um, yep, actually see him. We eat really early. Great take. You know, to be able to grab that early on. Yes, it's also the best early dragon that you can get. You know, getting oh, APA is getting really helps the laners and APA maybe need here. Help. Oh yeah, man, he has no TP either. Yo, I would literally be asking my jungler to come and dive. Oh, yeah, man. I, I don't know what it is about this matchup, but Dude, really Palafox just seems to is just him, him up mid. Crazy. So Palafox has something figured out. I feel like against this guy, or maybe it's one of those things where he's just his demon and he's slapping him in scrims, so he's going into it unconfident. But I don't know, like. APA versus Palafox and APA versus everyone else is two very different things, it feels like. Exactly. I mean, when, when Palafox came into the league, he also didn't get to join, you know, a top team kind of like APA did. So maybe Palafox wants to humble him a little bit. He's like, okay, you got to go to the world. <laughs> now, that's, that's it's actually so NA. crazy if you come in on a top team and then you just play on a bot team afterwards. <laughs> you gotta go through the trench first. It exactly. actually just will blow your mind. Palafox is definitely making this. Uh, you don't realize, because I mean, I got pretty lucky well. in my career. APA like, my, my first like real team that, standard, that I was on was Stigmatos, and they were like a top three Obviously, team in North America. You join the team and like everyone's like good. Sure the Your game is so fucking easy to play. Then bro, when I joined Curse post relegation, fight, like right after they like got relegated, they didn't get relegated, but they like were forced to play in the relegation tournament. It's like they're jungling. The whole fucking map is dark. No one's communicating where anything is. You're like, what the is happening? How do I play the game? Why did he not take the third grub? Because you wanted, because he was afraid that there was potentially going to be some type of answer play. I think the way that he views it is like. People so two grubs that denies them from getting, um, DPS, but like the six grubs, too, and it's right? Like the well, big difference between grubs is like between the fourth, fifth, and sixth like one. So if you get at least two, you're chilling. Yeah, and he could he could dead. still play for the next right. grub here. The thing is, like, it was it's so much time to do them, and also like when he goes to next time, it will have no shield. He probably just wanted to protect his bot side, like time efficiency thing. And the other two grubs will still respawn here. Umpty wants to try to step up. Doesn't this look sad contacts. though for Graves? Dude, I swear Graves is not that good of a champion right now. Like, I'm a Graves hater. I think that champion is so broken no. in a lot of situations. Like if you want, your counter plan doesn't work. Like, you know so how awesome. bad it Oh my go. god, so we gotta be hitting those. For team but dude, this is the thing about Energy's comp. This is why I thought they were gonna lose the game. It's like, I don't think Energy's that good when they don't have buttons to press. Even if you think about the way that they beat G2, the way they beat G2 was by playing comps where they had buttons and then just and sent it stuff, like, like contract is playing by Jarvan and he was just have, going uh, in engaging and making plays happen that's, like, that's what I think they're best at so I think who he's best when he has the ability to engage but then contracts like I think they want to like look at plays and be like okay we can kill this guy here at this point with the send it, you know? Like, they're not that good at transferring, like, positive pressure in lanes into, like, okay, like, now we, like, have good setups around objectives, we, like, deny vision, we put the enemy in an uncomfortable spot, and then we play, like, a, like a better macro game than the enemy. Um, I'm a little bit surprised about that. Like Obviously, they have they good enough setups to put themselves, the themselves the side, in positions where they, they, really speed, where they can have an advantage, and then their macro is like fight them. Pushed back here as who he's looking for. Yeah, Core JJ can just go on the match. Like you can tell that they want to fight, right? Like you see who he doing one. his thing. Contract like can't you tell that they want to like fight? Imagine if they had buttons. APA trying to get away. Palafox just putting the Oh man, Umpty should have like walked a little bit more up. Shotgun like to he, the was, face <laughs> there. he was kind of just, he's kind of just killing APA. APA I mean, APA is you know, for sure, right? It's APA's that, fault, but I, I think Umpty could have just like stood closer to the you're gonna be in that uh, the grave. After it hits him, Contract starting up this dragon now, but TL are still around. APA literally in, really needs to retire. Yeah, he should retire, bro. Exactly. The TP is played like probably less than one split combined, but yeah, let's just retire at this point. It. Also, TL just like, w the like the what, they just decided to like throw the entire game. They actually just decided, the they're like, you know what, let's just lose fight. the game. Contract has been killed on the side of energy, but now impacts in danger. Who he's going they to actually just, the wall, oh man, they gave the fight right the to the boys here. As Dokla is 1v2 and winning it. APA tries to get away as Core JJ lands the ulti. <laughs> they could have just easily just given this fucking Drake and like not given him. Like, their, their the mid laner the was dead. First with his There's no TV. reason to fight this, but they were like, all right, bro. Them from and you could tell in the last minute of play that Energy is so like horny to fight. Like, Energy really wants to fight. To this is only Energy's first Drake if they get it.
Think about it, there's him. nothing for the game. I'm actually yeah, surprised. Oh my god, who he ate the wrong person, bro. If who he just ate contracts, contracts lives as well. APA oh shows my up, god, I didn't even see that. I was looking at the bottom side of the fight. He was chasing down two members there from TL. That's pretty sad from who he man. To get away from it. Yep, but it's going to be able to force out that flash. And then so you're looking for the rinse and Oh my god. Okay, he ulted the buy. They did get caught there by the edge of the I think they just turn it around, no? Unstoppable in the buy ult it doesn't actually paralyze them. But now Umpty's got to try to get back out as he's going, bro. Who's the man on a mission? Won't find a target. Still looking to see what this and you have so much power from these okay uh, from these items i'll watch this flash here or has no flash here i mean apa starting it off wants to see if he he's solo killed apa solo killed his ass him low, but he won't kill him just that was actually like a pretty brutal solo kill i mean i don't know i, I guess palafox is trying to bait because people are coming but it was pretty we'll ugly man get the tower or anything not looking like it but he gets us that was a, a zero down 40 cs i don't know bro that's a rough lane this is my for you page jet daddy and yeah, sage mommy i don't give a about either of you anytime you die 1v1 it's always one that you want back well, okay core that's a flash he was he was all right it in the lane. i mean i guess he's he saves hp CS. because drake is he like up i still don't even think it's that easy for energy but who knows let's see dragon, but everyone else is here except for your jungler and that's it's kind of rough for the setup but we'll see if it can get here anyway all right true shot barrage over the top i'm too ready to try to fight here in the 1v1 for the oh my god they lost it to ezreal q second time today you gotta be cba God, Ezreal is the new jungler, apparently, back to back games. Ezreal well, steals was looking it away. pretty okay until today. Yeah, today, to today was not a good here. day so far, Scoring but it is what it is. Oh, JJ's oh, not JJ not I feel like this is a game, though, where FBI will actually just start 1v9ing. Like, he's kind of a yeah, carry really center. Nice I believe in him. Dude, yeah, I hate playing Graves and Poppy, by the way. This shit is miserable. I would hate playing Graves in competitive in general. Like, if jungle's not strong, I would not want to play this champion. In metas where, like, jungle is broken, sure, and play Graves, right? It's like one of the best. Like, whenever it's a. The way that you can tell if jungle is strong or not is whether junglers are playing Vi, Rel, Maokai, Sejuani, Trundle, Skarner, these types of champs, or if junglers are playing like Nidalee, Graves, Kindred, these types of champs. When jungle is strong, people play carry junglers. If jungle is weak, uh, unless you'll just play other things really and i think jungle position, is weak right so now so do not play things like graves because you're just gonna be down sure levels like right graves is a champion that wants to be like the highest level like in the game he wants to be like super far ahead <laughs> if you get on top of the guy close. the guy is dead lethality graves and gangplank barrels follow fps rules as yon tries to get away get flashed down for a while they aren't gonna be able to finish oh man who you gotta eat your boy danger gonna be scooped up by who he and kept safe Everybody's a nice golden statue. Wait, can they Baron off this? Torn down. I think they just Baron, no? Yeah, let's, let's, let's do the Baron. Baron is Baron. What yeah. category is Brand fall in? I mean, Brand is just like an exception Goldblum, because the champion is just absurdly like broken for no reason, you know? It just doesn't have anything to do with like the jungle. It's just simply Brand is broken. They like overbuffed for no reason Brand's jungle ability. And now he's just like an OP champion. That like just should be nerfed. Okay, his fleet and stuff. Uh, uh, Drake is up. Ezreal, Bro, how do we not have a Drake timer oh, in LCS? That's Drake kind of crazy to me. Here real soon. Remember, it's still really, we just have no Drake timer? For the side of Team Liquid, thanks to the steal they got over the last one. Core JJ escaping through the wall, getting away from Big Dopes. But the Q3 knocks him back, but the Intofo strikes. That he flash was flash, literally JJ half a millimeter. Energy now trying to regroup. TL still grouped up as more of a squad. Uh, okay, let's see this. I mean, I, uh, this oh my god, he just ulted on team. ends up ulting his own dude. Is happening, bro. Is not too scared about where this one's going. Now they go over the wall. They try to get bound up, but it's Core JJ still not finding what it All right, take the Drake, guys. Oh my God, dude, Core, Core we gotta, we gotta get it together, dude. I'm, I'm, I'm struggling to still defend you, Core. Core ever returned to his form? I don't know, man. He's had like, he's, he's had not been playing for a while now. It has felt like throughout this game. Uh, coming off that Olay game where it felt like Olay was really on point, it is really kind of a tale of two bards. And yeah, no, I mean, Azale is 100% right, bro. I like that he's actually mentioning that shit. Like, Ole was... I mean, Ole so far, this split has been much better than Core JJ. This is what it is. Ole's had a solid split. Like, the two bar games were good. The Maokai game was good. Like, I mean, I feel like, like he's been pretty on point for support they're doing baron he'll get away back he was bought they're doing baron let's see if bard can ult install 
to half HP. Dope is gonna recall, and then they need the Baron ult. Or they need the Bard ult. The Baron install. Baron being bursted low. Ole by time. That might be the big Bard ulti that they need. Good from Palafox, by the way. Smart from Palafox. I like that, bro. Palafox intentionally took that to get ulted out so that his jungler can fight. Yeah, that is great for energy. I, like energy out. has like that they're, they're a team that's the main thing that i like about them they play like a team because like minutes. it's also good because he would have had to flash out of the back of the pit so he saves his flash while doing this as well yeah they got four turrets or no they got three turrets with the baron i mean it's not bad they can still potentially pressure bots here too here i mean this is just not a game ending baron bro this is what it is i think i think they got enough off this dokla might get caught he has to go he's probably okay as Dokla gets out with the, the team can get to him, no? To Wait, the boys can get to him, no? Wait, Yeon is just dead. Wait, no, he's not dead. I felt like they could... I mean, I guess they went for inhibitor any... Like, okay, I guess I can see it. I just feel like the enemy team is kind of inting, but... They made the decision. They made the call really early that they did not want to test this. The thing is, now it's, like, scary, bro. And Huli just needs to eat him, and they just need to try to get the fuck out. Safety, but this is really sus. They're gonna they lose Drake off the. Actually, the maybe they don't lose Drake. Oh, no, they lose Drake. But that's gonna be interrupted as Palafox and APA get into a 1v1, but it ain't gonna be a 1v1 for long because FBI is coming in. The shutdown back over the yard of the graves. FBI slashing and dashing back over the wall to the safety of the Krugs. But the Krugs are gonna keep chasing them. FBI does not want to let the chicken emperor go. APA runs back underneath the sun disc. Mm, they lose Drake for this. FBI I mean, that, I don't know. I, I think that they, they can probably okay. make it to Dokla now. Like if they are on tier two and the second a Dokla starts getting jumped on, they just kill the tier two and they start running up towards him. And they don't get the bot in Hib. And I guess they wanted the bot in Hib to leverage into Baron in 220, which makes sense. But then you lose third mountain if Dokla dies. Which is like kind of scary. So, I'm not sure about it, bro. I have mixed feelings. They can't do this. They're going to have to just try to get TL to show and then walk back to Baron. It will be the play. And they just have to walk back to Baron now. But now energy's got to be careful. They wanna, don't want to fall victim to the pincer attack. Who he using the abyssal dive to get back out? And that that bot lane hit has respawned now. So now they don't even have that extra pressure. I mean, this is why I didn't like the bot hit play. It's gonna be because like they they weren't able to leverage right it. It's like not that easy to leverage that bot hit. They don't want to deal with this potential soul or maybe caught. Okay, who he? Oh, that's an ugly bard ult, bro. That's a really bad bard ult. It doesn't do anything. No way for anybody else to follow it up. Both sides. I mean, the thing about for energy here, the reason why this isn't really massive for energy is they have to contest the Drake. Soul is gonna spawn soon, so they need to they need to push mid and get to soul. They're gonna have to reset. They're gonna have to be oh, APA? APA, APA has a flash. It's pretty big. Dokla has TP. He took a lot of HP. He took a lot of his uh, HP. Energy damage here. I'm is looking. Oh, oh, okay. Let's see. Let's see the play. This could be like a game ending play. This looks pretty f***ing big. Palafox. Big play from Palafox. They have to kill APA. They killed APA. Everybody's dead. A triple kill back over to Palafox. Energy have cut him to pieces. Can they just end bot? Can they end here? I don't know if they can end, actually. I don't they think they can. Wait, here. can they? It's pretty close. It's pretty... Uh, no, they can't, I don't think. They do have five grubs. They do have five grubs. Maybe, maybe they can. Maybe they can. I think Poppy can, like, stall for a long time, though. Like, these champions can't really kill Poppy. Let's see what Poppy can do. In the middle of it. Let's see it. Let's see it. Let's see it. I'm down. I'm down for it. Versus energy. Energy. With they just have to. Push. I don't know, bro. They can't hit the poppy, can they? So that's a big one of the damage threats here. Impact is a tanky boy, but is he tanky? I mean, I don't know, bro. I think the poppy can stall. Ulti from Core JJ to buy him a little bit of extra time. I think he can kill the poppy and then go back to Drake and then turn that into a. But energy's gonna get away. Contract actually failed as he over the wall. Go back to Drake and get Baron as well. Energy be there. It's a hundred percent over. I mean, it just wasn't over, bro. Poppy is like. Incredibly thank you for these, these people. Die, they probably can the only one that can really kill Poppy is Oriana. And they deny Soul, and then FBI they can go towards Baron. Poppy is dead for 22. They don't want to take it any lower. They don't want to risk anything. They're going to drop the ward into the tri brush. They see who's, they who's the getting position. bought, bro. Team who's getting bought? Between a rock and a hard place. It's a double Poppy's trying to go bot. Crashing in the Nexus turrets. Now they start again. Are playing it slow and playing it safe. Poppy has they're, they're going to try to get Poppy CP. I mean, the bot turret is dead. Impact. Bottom uh, Nexus turret is dead. One Nexus turret remaining. 
Umpty's gonna have to try to make some sort of a hero play, but energy doesn't want to give him the chance. All five pulling off of the objective yet again. They're going back to it. Back mm, the they turned, but they didn't actually turret. get too Umpty's much off the turn. Poppy's actually getting to clear. The wall, but now he's running into enemy territory. They're they're he's lost. So far, they're, this the is just is becoming a. Impact has TP now. This is becoming so the clown music. Be available once more here. Energy aren't able to just burst this down. You can see Palafox is hunting for Umpty. Okay, Baron down below half. Palafox trying to keep up these zoned away. Here comes the TP coming out from Impact. This fight is going to tell a well, lot about Dokla the Well, just game. walking Dokla into them, bro. He just doesn't give a f***. APA. So now Big. Over the top. Up, he's going to be taken low. Palafox now the target. Oh, Palafox is dead? Palafox ain't going to get him yet. Core JJ with a shot. Hold up. Winnable. Trying to escape from contract, but he won't do it. The 12 gauge goodbye gets him. As APA will be double killed by the grave. It's two dead on TL. It's one dead on the side of energy. As FBI tries to get away from Impact, who doesn't get the wall oh bang. My now God. Impact's going to be locked. now in. see them onto the Baron here once again. Now Impact shows bot. It's just two members here to try to sit, push them off, but Young gets big damage on FBI. Yeah, FBI I don't know what's going on here, bro. This is a little there, crazy, isn't the it? The damage from Baron and the damage from the True Shot Barrage, who he knows it, and he's trying to body block through the Mystic Shot. There's no Umpty available. The Baron is going to be claimed by Contract. Yes, it's fine, bro. I guess they actually got the, the numbers advantage. To close the they just end it. They can literally just end, right? Can they end? Can they just end with... Uh, they don't have top wave, bro. Their waves are in such bad state. They didn't actually push any of their waves before they did it. They can't even end here. The reason these games take so long is no one's actually we'll pushing the waves before they make any of these plays. Mm. How fast talking shit is making me feel like I need to root for... The very least, they're gonna get yeah. him and Bro, let him talk some shit. Gone, so two nibs down. This guy was getting shit on in LCS for like years. Everyone was calling him bad. He's on top now, he gets to talk some shit. That's how it works. With a 5v5 in the enemy base, they go Ooh, for the Cal Fox got only hit CC'd. They sent it on to so FBI. Umpty is trying to let... Uh, Umpty is like borderline solo killing FBI. Yeah, that should be game. Oh, there's a top wave. Somebody has to buff up the mid wave that has Baron. Cal Fox was looking for base CP, but I mean, he doesn't have time to do it. So it's not triple in him just yet, but energy could change that in the blink of an eye. Dokka trying to jump forward, finds the Intofo strikes of the APA. Okay, Cal Fox, can he burst him out of it? No, he can't. Impact trying to get back. Sundance breaks on top of the ruins of Nexus turret number one. Has Nexus turret number two falls. Bottom lane inhibitor. Oh, Contract's kind of got caught here, but. Contract is shuffled in. Oh my god, he actually killed him. What the f? Well, that was a game. That right there was a fing game. Jesus what a Christ. Back and forth game here. Energy playing without much engagement. Dude, whatsoever, umpty after. But they find bro, a way fucking umpty to after like, like two weeks in North really America, man. Some high pressure situations <laughs> from a number of the energy members. Umpty they after to two one. weeks in North America. Currently in sole possession of first Jesus. place in yes, the LCS. Look at him, bro. Oh my God, bro. And it's, it's another game.